Version two of the Tundra is underway. If you guys missed the last two videos, we installed rear and front bumpers on it. And today we are going to be tackling some new LED projector headlights. Now these headlights are super sick. I can't wait to get them in, but you guys are probably thinking to yourself, why are you replacing your headlights when you already did? So really quick, I'll tell you a few reasons as to why, and then we'll get straight into the install. So the first main reason, you guys can't really tell in video here, they are starting to yellow. And so because they have a little bit of a yellowish tint, I was either going to resurface them or go ahead and just replace them. But our next reason is the main reason why I am replacing these headlights. So the main reason is these bulbs in here actually are not as bright as I had hoped. To be completely honest, the fog lights on my last bumper, the stock one, were much brighter than these headlights. So for visibility purposes at night, since it gets dark super quick here in Utah, I'm going to be replacing these headlights with an LED projector that's going to be much, much brighter. And the last reason I'm going to be replacing these headlights is this bar here is supposed to be a DRL light, but unfortunately you have to do some splicing and wiring. And because I am not the greatest at it, I did not want to screw up anything. So the DRLs never got wired in. Now the new headlights that I have are going to replace all of those issues. They're not going to be yellowing. They are not going to be super dim. And the DRLs come with the pre-wired kit. All I have to do is plug it into the fuse box. Now I'm sure you guys are dying to see what headlights I picked up. So let's go ahead and let's unbox the new headlights made by Alpha Rex. how beautiful that headlight is. I can't wait to throw these guys on to show you guys exactly what they look like, but these things look amazing. So let's go ahead and I'll show you guys how to remove the old ones, and then we'll throw on our new Alpha Rex LED projector headlights. We'll start by removing the two plastic clips that hold the headlight extension in place, and then we're going to gently wiggle it out of place. Next you will have three bolts, two up top and one on the side that hold the headlight in place. We're going to remove those and then we'll pull our headlight out and disconnect everything. All right, now that we've got our headlight removed, we wanna take our new headlight and we wanna get it all put into place and plug in all of our electrical. So let's start with doing that and I'll show you guys the process and we'll get it all plugged in and ready to go for our next step. Once we've got it all plugged in, we then want to add their wire harness. So there's going to be these small plugs that we can plug into our headlight here. We're also going to plug it onto our battery and also one into our fuse. That way the DRLs turn on when the key turns on and we'll have DRL functions. So we're going to go ahead and throw this in and then we'll check out our finished product. All right guys, and there you have it, the new Alpha Rex Lux LED projector headlights installed on my Toyota Tundra. Honestly, I think they turned out way too clean. I love the way that they look. I'm super glad I chose the Alpha Black colorway. I think it looks cynical, super clean and aggressive, and I cannot wait to get the rest of this truck dialed in. If you guys do want to pick them up for yourself, I'm going to leave the link in the description below. They have lots of different options. They have halogen projectors, LED projectors, 
and they even have a projector that has four LEDs instead of the one like mine do. Now, if you guys are as excited as I am for the Toyota Tundra build, smash that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out anything. Let me know in the comments section below what you wanna see done next, and don't forget to like the video so I know you guys are enjoying the content, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.